Time to talk about Nightmare Claws. I mean, Nightmare Claws is something really, really cool, I show you. I mean, this is just plain black, okay? What I'm wearing is just plain black, which arguably is looking very good on a true black nightmare. However, there are Nightmare Claws here, and here is a perfect example. And here, for instance, I have this one and this one. Okay, let's take a look, for instance, okay. Okay, parental advisor here, 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 here. You see, you see the, the it, it looks different. And if you, if you are basically on um, on a long main nightmare or or even a short nightmare, well, it, it definitely matches. There's four fashions of this nightmare hue, and how do you tell one from the other? Well, you. you you see there are four fashions here well five this is a this is not a nightmare you you go to the razor you go to razor and then you go to the to the targeting menu of razor i cannot show you here because i, I don't know how to do that okay you go display counter okay and you go to add add and you target the thing you wish to to, to to identify and it tells you the color for instance this one that I targeted is uh, 1108 and if I target this one is 1109 1109 is the real nightmare color the darkest one then you have the light ones 1107 and the lightest one 1106 so you have 1106 7 8 and 9 these are the nightmare color but you cannot obtain this uh, by uh, using a dying tab because if you use a die tab here, a regular die tab, you only obtain uh, three digits and there is no way you can obtain a four digit color. So you have to farm them. And how do you farm them? Well, there's five places where you can farm them and they are from mages and pieces. So let's grab a book here. I have a book with mages and pieces, I guess which is not this one, but this one, Nightmare Cloth. Okay, let's grab the Nightmare Cloth and let's organize here, what a mess. Okay, Nightmare Cloth. They spawn in five places. Let's put the map on and I'll show you guys. Okay, here we have Shame Level 3 West. Let's go. Shame Level 3 West is here, this tower. And if you go inside, where the poison elemental is, here is very nasty. If you go inside, okay, here you see many, many red NPCs mages. Okay, there's 12 of them, I guess, I believe, if I remember correctly. Let's get rid of circle. Come on. Okay, here. There you are. You see? These two guys. Let's try and get rid of these guys. Okay. Let's get rid of these guys. Okay, one is dead. Let's get rid of the other guy. And if you see, they drop a robe. Okay, they drop gold. A lot of gold, actually. And a robe. The mount is ill. Wow. Okay, they drop a robe. You can loot the robe here. And honestly, I'm not sure if you need uh, tailoring to cut it and obtain a uh, bolt of cloth but let's imagine okay you collect this and this can be in the four fashion like 1106 7 8 and 9 okay and you can collect them so a robe is uh, 16 cloth and if you cut it okay we, we can try cut it now double click and cut it okay let's see I've collected three. Let's cut the other. It's another color for sure. It's lighter. And this one I've collected eight. So maybe it's not really dependent on, on tailoring. I have GM tailor and I, 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 don't, I don't see you obtaining more than half of what it's uh, the, the, the cost of making it. So if, it's co if it, the cost of this one is 16, so you can obtain eight at max. I'm not sure I... I, I have to investigate, to be honest, but, well, this is how you obtain them. So this is the first place, Shamist. You you have another, and you have two here. Then you have uh, 
another place that is yes, sorry, this is Shame West, then you go to Shame East with a similar situation here, you see there's a guy here and you kill it there we go and here is another one yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be easy with the nightmare ouch ouch it's nasty casters, yeah, yeah, you have to you have to be um, Worry, because uh, these guys cast very, very much. But again, here again another robe, and here again another robe. Okay, and some nice gold to be honest. These robes are also a unique color. You cannot obtain via die tab, but yeah, I, I, I don't think that matters to be honest. Nobody uses this color as far as I, as far as far as I can tell. Okay, let's get rid of spawn here. Okay. Ouch! They really they have really beaten the nightmare down. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Uh, double click. Okay. They added this one. Double click. Okay, this is the true nightmare cloth. Okay, six six bolts. Okay, this is another place. This is the same place where the damaged books spawn in this bookcase. Okay, every eighteen to twenty days. Okay, then we have another spot, which is this spice island, where we only have one mage here, I guess. Somebody definitely here. Hold on. Sorry, that was my wife on the phone. Okay, here you only have one mage. This guy here. Actually two, why two? That's very strange. Let's get rid of these guys. Okay. I thought you had... I, I, I really think you have one here. It's really strange that you only have... That you have two, that I found two here. Hmm, well, let's see, let's get rid of them and see, after a round, we determine how much Nightmare Cloth we, we have farmed. And then we will also determine how much Nightmare Cloth is needed to, for instance, uh, how is it called, craft a BJV uniform. Because I, I'm really debated of using this color and with some characters ride, riding like the long mane nightmare the short one i don't like the short one but the long mane well it surely it is something in that it's worth investigating to be honest okay let's try not to die here yeah he resisted rel poor yeah this guy is wearing a very light cloth Very light cloth. Let's get rid of these guys. And these mages have a lot of HPs. They are human, but they have a lot of HPs, to be honest. You actually make gold by killing these mages. I never realized, honestly. I never realized you make so much gold. This is an actual nice way of farming, to be honest. Come on, do you have line of sight, Nightmare, or do I have to kill this guy for you? Oh, there, there's many. Okay, let's move to the next place. Next place is gonna be in T2A, so n Northern Territories. Here we go. I couldn't mount the Nightmare because it was aggroed. Okay, let's go here, put Reflect on. And we go to the Ice Fiends. Ice Fiends, you only have one mage here. Okay, it is uh, nice fins. There you go, the one mage there. So how do we get rid of that guy? Okay, let's meditate here. Here we are, med up. Let's drop an Eevee here. Okay. Yeah, 
here, so let's get scrolls. Boy, I hate fizzling on spells. Even in 2023, you fizzle spells. There we go. And there we go. Okay. Where is the mage? Here is the mage. Okay. There we go. Let's see what kind of cloth this guy has. Well, well these ice fiends are really easy kills. A lot of fame and a lot of karma, a lot of fame and a lot of karma everywhere. Even if you are lord. Yeah, these are the highest giving fame mob in the in the land. Compared to the, I think it's the same as Baron, as the same as the Ancient Worm. Yeah, Circle of Transparency, it's handy, but I don't like it. Okay, let's mount it. Let's loot also this guy, because why not? And so let's loot this guy. We only have one mage here, unfortunately. Okay, here. And with slow spawn, I mean, if you if you're gonna do this, the spawn you have to keep in mind that the spawn is very is very slow. So you kill them, and uh, yeah, you come back after a while. To be honest, to to actually loot them, to actually kill some more. Okay, this is another place that we've done, and there is one more place, two more places, which is fire mages. This is nasty. This is nasty. You have many, 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 many here. I honestly. Yeah, you have. No, I'm not gonna do this. Yeah, but you, you, you have many. Oh, maybe let, let's do this. Let's do this. How do we do that? Maybe like this. Let's see. Okay. Yeah, we need this item. Okay. And the EV is doing the job. Yeah, this is probably the best way of doing it. Even though the best way of doing it would be having a room here, uh, putting a tame somewhere there so that the all the mages are the tame. And another one spawned. Okay, let's go, let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll with the nightmare. Let's protect the nightmare, baby. Yay! Farming. Farming. The nightmare is the is the boss here. Okay. So let's see. One here. And gold. Another here. Oh, this looks like real nightmare cloth. And another here. And here, the one that we didn't looted, that we didn't loot. Here. And there are some also on the North Tower, I guess. Let me check. Yeah, here also at the North Tower. Ouch. Yeah, exactly. I don't I don't recall how many to be honest. Okay, let's grab the robe. We're almost overloaded. Yeah, server save. Why these guys are wrecking the nightmare? I have to keep it healed. And another mage lord spawn. Let me check. Yeah, there is one mage lord down here. Here is very nasty the corridor here because it's only one tile. Very nasty. Annoying. Definitely annoying. Okay, where is the mage lord? There. Oh, there's many, many boys. Yo, whoa! Flame striking babies. Flame striking babies. Ouch. 
Plane strike, baby. I cannot cast a fucking spell. Come on, keep being disturbed. This guy is with Restle. Yeah, okay. Let's go. Let's go. One more mage to kill. One more mage lord to kill. Yeah, insta flame strike. Good boy, nightmare. Okay. That sounds about right. I've seen people farming these guys here, to be honest, in the past. I, ha I haven't seen anyone here lately. Le by lately, I mean the last couple of years. Maybe not in the last year. Okay, so this is um, fire. And we only have one place left, which is fire entrance. Here. You only have one. Yeah. Very, very popular place during Age of Shadow era because you couldn't recall inside dungeons during Age of Shadow. And I'm dying here. What? Ah, almost overload, yeah. During Age of Shadow, you couldn't recall inside dungeons, so they put teleport inside dungeons to move through dungeons. And here was a very common teleport because you would recall to the fire entrance and here you go to, the, to this teleport and you go to, the, to Despise where Baroquin spawn was. Okay, so here we are. We collected all the cloth. And let's see how much cloth did we collect. Okay. This, this. Let's cut everything. Everything. Let's cut everything. But well, we farmed a lot. Okay, so we have three. 26, uh, 51, 51, 69. And bear in mind that to craft a BJV uniform with, with this color, you need 24 plus 8. 24 for the gesture suit and 8 for the kilt. So that's 32. So we, we basically have material here for two gesture suits. And we farm almost 10k. I mean, did we really farm 10k or did I have something with me? I have to re review the video, but yeah, we, we, we've killed like more than 10 mage lords. Yeah, we definitely farm 10k here, I believe. Okay, so here again, it was also popular, I was saying, during Age of Shadow, because during Age of Shadow era, you could recall inside towns, even with reds, you could not perform, of course, criminal acts, but the fact that you were red was not a problem during Age of Shadow. So even as red, I was recalling here. Okay, here and straight to, to that teleport for dungeons like Despise and I believe it was Destard. Yeah, it was just like knowing by heart every connection of the dungeon, yeah. Okay, I guess we have covered everything for this, for this video and Honestly, you can make gold because if you're selling these, there's people actually buying. I am buying it for sure. This this kind of cloth, and I, I don't know, maybe it's 100 gold pieces per yard. So this is three yards, so that's going to be 300 gold pieces. So that's definitely something interesting. There used to be a guy running a fashion vendor, Randall Thor. Where are you, Randy boy? Yeah, he was selling uh, all this kind of cloth. There are more. Um, let's say unique color cloth for instance you have healers wandering healers with the the, the yellow the yellow robe you have these uh, red mages that have the red robes and there are more i believe i, I i'm not very certain there should be some sort of rare green cloth i don't know where you obtain that from yeah i have to investigate they're really cool some of them match the nightmare some of them for instance they they match the verite uh, some of them match the velorite uh, the nightmare of course matches the shadow ion oh yeah that's very very interesting maybe the, the healer matches matches perfectly the gold the gold plate yeah definitely interesting I hope you learned something from this video and if you do and if you enjoy my content put a like, subscribe and uh, share the content and come play Ultima Line Second Age because that's the greatest shard ever invented thanks to Derek, thanks to GM Umland Jenkins for, for content and thanks everybody for watching and thank GM Links Panther for yeah 
for being a GM. <laughs> yeah. Stay safe, citizen of Britannia, and get out of here. <laughs>